Good afternoon everybody, it's Michelle Newton here, the Aussie Angel Lady with you for another possible update, our last day, we're in the closing hours of the possible launch, there's less than four hours to go, it closes tonight at 8pm Melbourne time, so we have um, under four hours to go uh, in the possible launch, um, there is 18 collector's editions of the Angel Rose Oracle available, um, only 18. If you would like your copy, um, hurry, 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 because time is running out. So it's a beautiful, my beautiful new Oracle. Hello, Lulu, Jan, lovely to see you here. Um, collector's edition, we have had, what have we had, 132 pledged so far out of the 150, and we only have 18 left to go. You have four hours to grab your copy of that. It will come with a number, so you can look up that angel number to see what it means in my angel numbers app, which is awesome. So please like and share this stream, give me some hearts, I love that. I'm gonna draw a card for you all here. If you're on the call, it's a message for you. <clears throat> if you are on the replay, it is also a message for you. And please share it far and wide, I'd really be grateful of that. Hello Louise, how are you? Lovely to have you here. Thank you for tagging one of your friends in the live, which is really beautiful of you to do. Uh, I'm so thrilled with the outcome of the possible launch. I would just love to get the next 18 out, but if we can't, we can't. Um, I believe in the angels and uh, I know that your support has been amazing. So we are nearly there. Uh, not quite there, but you know, so close, isn't it? So only 18 oracles left. You can pledge number two gives you, uh, the second pledge gives you one oracle, the third pledge gives you two oracles. <clears throat> Please select your shipping option because it'll just come up with AOK -okay Healing Centre Pickup, um, which won't be appropriate if you don't live near me, which is in Shepparton. There's a little arrow, you click that, two more options drop down. One says shipping Australia wide and one says shipping international. Please choose your appropriate shipping because shipping is on top of the, um, the pledge. So I'm very grateful for that. So hello Marie and Roxanne, lovely to have you here. Thank you so much Marie, lovely. Thank you for the hearts, mean so much to me. Can I purchase one and pick up from Shepparton? Yes Louise, you can go in now and you can go, I will put the link in the description when I finish, and I'll put the link in the comments, and then when you get to shipping, you select the first option, which is pick up Shepparton. All right, doll? So that's easy for you to do. Let me choose a card for you all now. Uh, and we will contact you when they're ready to pick up, of course, because we've got, we're going to have um, like 130 parcels to pack, hopefully 150, who knows? Hello, Kathy from the UK, lovely to have you here this afternoon. It's this afternoon in Australia. Uh, 20 past four in the afternoon. Hello, Catherine. Uh, lovely to have you here too. Let me know where you live. I'd love to know where you live and how far we're reaching. The angels are taking forever. I'm just, there we go. When they clump, that means they're ready. <clears throat> and we don't rush the angels, do we? Now, I've already had that card. I'm going to choose the next one. And I've had that as well. Ah, excitement. This is a great card for the last four hours of the possible launch. Let's have a read about this. I'll pop it up really close so that you can see the card closely. How beautiful is this card? <clears throat> Hello, Lynn. So let's look up the guidebook. Comes The Oracle comes with a guidebook. I'll just get there, here we go. Very cool. Excitement. The sight of the celestial trunk being, brings forth feelings of anticipation and excitement for what it may contain. Symbolically, the trunk can represent what it is you are searching for in life. The angels implore, if you are looking for happiness or love, it could be standing right in front of you already. If you feel lost, incomplete or insecure, it is time to find the things that have made you feel whole in the past. The orange butterflies, you can see them there, may deliver a joyful heavenly treasure, such as a windfall of money, jewels or diamonds, quite unexpectedly. Oh, that's exciting. Rewards for personal achievement and effort could also come your way at this time. 
The celestial trunk can also symbolize finding something that you thought was lost. Now that's very exciting. Hello Angela from Northern Ireland, hello to you today. So this is, I've got an itchy nose, so that means Archangel Michael's in the house. Other meanings for the symbols in this card, celestial trunk, windfalls, wealth, knowledge, history, success, value, secrets, enlightenment, and magic. The orange butterflies, sun, life, consciousness, healing, passion, courtesy, friendliness, liveliness, positivity, joy, rebirth, happiness, renewal, and beauty. The sky may, can mean the future, the sky's the limit, reach to the heavens, no limitation to success, your potential, infinity and order. Now let's go to some wisdom because every card, I'll just show you this card closely again, it's really, really gorgeous, very exciting. What does your trunk contain? Very beautiful blessing. Hello Audrey, hello Angela. Some wisdom from the Little Flower St. Therese because this oracle is dedicated to St. Therese and Mother Mary and all the angels because of the roses, the high vibration of the rose. Just as the sun shines on all the trees and flowers as if each were the only one on earth, so does God care for all souls in a special manner. How beautiful is that? Let me read it again. Just as the sun shines on all the trees and flowers, as if each were the only one on earth, so does God care for all souls in a special manner. No matter who they are, every single soul on this planet is cared for. No matter what they've done, no matter what they're going to do, they are cared for by God. Hello, Susan. Oh, you're looking at water. Is, is that good or not, Susan? Let me know. Uh, yes, so that's a beautiful message from St. Teresa, the little flower. Excitement. Well, I'm very excited about the possible launch. I'm very excited that we've been very successful. I would love, love, love if we could manage to get the next 18 out into people's hands. I'd be so, so grateful. Hello, Karen and Louise and Amanda. Um, 18 left. There's less than four hours to go in the possible launch. Jump on there and get your oracle. We're sending worldwide. Um, the shipping is already set and it's very reasonable for international folks. Plus, don't forget, the Australian dollar is awful, so it won't be as bad as you think. Yes, so that's good news. So there you go, guys. Thank you very much. Oh, sitting on the grass sounds divine, Susan. Sitting there looking at the water. It's nothing better than calming than looking at the water. Isn't it? It's beautiful and very grounding sitting on the grass. So thank you for being here. I'm very excited. I'll come back to you again this evening just prior to the close and let you know how we're going, um, especially for people that have been at work and mightn't realise we're about to close the possible launch. So, um, and as I said, there will only be 150 of these because that's all the cards I've got printed um, in the collector's edition, which is very, very beautiful. Hello, Mel. How are you, beautiful? Yes, Susan, nature is the best. It's just amazing. It's very, very healing and very beneficial for all of us. So take care and ah, fruit tingles and we lost the whole thing. Oh, God, never mind. It's, everything's good. Oh, dear. I nearly lost my tripod with my little phone standing on it. Never mind. Not to worry. All's well. Same day. Have a great afternoon and I'll see you later. Bye-bye. I'll pop the link in the description and the comments. Thank you. Bye.